Hi Pisces, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 24th until the 30th. Okay, so let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Well, I decided to do the uh, Pisces first rather than Aries. It says that there are a lot of Pisces before it's been like requesting, but I'm only doing it right now. I mean for this week only. Oh. Mm-hmm. Well, there are actually <coughs> two things that will be coming your way which are really good, you know. Um somebody from the past will be reemerging again. And there is also a very promising amount that you will also be getting this week. I feel like this is, you know, the one that you've been really waiting for. And I feel like, you know, this is the moment that you have been, like, anticipating to come for you to make a brand new beginning. All right. Especially for those who's been trying to think of, like, an additional investment or additional um, financial source. Hmm while you're working and while you're being employed now this is you know this is a very good week for you however i feel like there is like um a person that you're still holding on to you know which is uh, another water sign and i feel like um you do have some karmic ties with this person most likely i feel like this is a scorpio and uh, you've been having a hard time, okay, moving on or trying to let go of this person since that for you, you have that very strong connection together. You just couldn't really give up and you don't even know why is it that this person is too, you know, it's like they have that very strong pull towards you. Yet on the other hand, you are also starting to consider some other things, you know, in your life that you know that you need to balance and that you need to focus on as well you feel so stuck in your personal aspect but when it comes to your finances everything is continuously moving especially when it comes to your career Finan you know your finances there is a financial windfall or there's like a huge amount of money okay like what i said it's a promising amount that you'll be very delighted and you'll be very um happy to hear and to have this week and I feel like there is a, um, there is a fire sign woman, you know, that will be like offering you an investment or will be asking you for a loan. You need to think long and hard about this, okay? This is not really a very good week for you or this is not really a very good time for you to uh, sign any contracts, meet other people for investments. You know, you can start scouring for ideas or you know like researching about the things that you need to know about this um what do you call this about this um whole thing you know uh this investment that you're thinking about or project but right before finalizing everything right before writing the check showing the uh, the the cash especially if the person is trying to push you you know, to to um, to finish it off or to um, get a down payment, don't. Okay, it's not really going to pan out well. Now, there is also another fire sign man that you've been like thinking about or that you've been like um, trying to balance. Okay, if this person is. Uh, worth it or not or if this person should be you know um should be um around your life or should be around your your plans on the other hand if you can control this older fire sign person you know he could be re very helpful to you and he could be um, a very big use to you but if you're unable to control this person and instead he is the one who's been controlling you expect that this person will be driving you into a lot of difficulties and struggles and this person will also be lying to you 
meaning that you know if they can see that they can manipulate you they will try to steal something from you now for you to make a brand new beginning there are a lot of things that you need to be a little bit more sharp and observant okay and you also need to analyze like is this you know real you know if the if the promise or if the return of in, of investment is too good to be true or if it's like um you know like it's like a big shot or it's a big risk then hold it off right now okay your money won't go away if you just put it in the bank for a little while and wait until you're fully ready wait until you're fully prepared you know you've made all the researches and you've done all of your you know studies and balancing and consulted a lot of people you know who also have um same experience or who can share you know their um their skills and the some of their advices because you're a newbie into this field or into this business so that will be a very good thing but right now i um i feel like try to hold off any types of investments or any types of you know finalizing or signing any contract all right be very careful also in investing in any uh, pyramid scheme or um in a business that you feel like you know like they are promising a lot of like it's too good to be true amounts okay if what if the amount that you're holding right now you just want to multiply it you know try to divert it in another um another investment for now but before going into a huge investment or before making that major decision wait until the retrograde is over so that you will have a clear mind and you will have a clear path and you will also have a clear vision all right now about this person or about this personal decision that you're currently struggling you know that even though that there is like a very shallow foundation in the past you're still looking into the possibility of taking this to the next level or if this you know um if this have any possibility of taking it to that next level even though you know that this person can really be trusted or they've already hurted you in the past uh, you need to think long and hard again i also feel like you will start thinking or you will start looking into new house or you know we'll start planning about relocation or relocating into another city another place another area but do not move in with anyone during this week because it's not really gonna turn out so good and it will be against your favor okay and um it seems like there is another water sign which is more likely cancer and an older fire sign more likely um aries you know who's been waiting for your decision as well and who's also been looking into your your contribution i feel like this is uh, this is more something to do with your work rather than your personal choice i also feel like you will have some disagreements with either your uncle or like a father image or like your actual father this week okay something that you will not be agreeing upon and then it will just end up in a very heated argument and you will be walking out or storming out of your house or storming out of their house all right now there's also a younger earth sign and a younger air sign that's been trying to manipulate you and they're most likely getting away from it okay if these are your friends then you have to start thinking more about yourself and you have to start thinking and balancing your own decision instead of asking other people about what you should be doing to your life or what you should be doing next because you are the only one who can um secure that and who can make a final end plus again okay there is you know there are actually three types of money that will sorry three uh, three resources or three opportunities 
or three financial windfall that's going to be coming your way. I also feel like some of you will be going on a travel or will be traveling near um, Niagara Falls or you're going to be visiting um, a place where there's like water and or waterfalls okay by the weekends and just for you to unwind and just for you to take some time off if you're stressed you know but there are three very good things which is you know it's all related to money or your career job opportunities it's also going to be coming or if you're waiting for a promotion it will definitely be offered to you or if you're waiting for an increment bonus uh, rewards commissions it will be coming to you this week as far as gambling is concerned, I don't really feel like it's uh, it has something to do with gambling. Um, well, there is a game of chance that you will be winning, but do not bet. Okay, do not gamble. That's actually um, not really advisable for you for this week. Or, or even if you will try to bet on a lottery. Uh, well, I can give you three numbers. The rest, you have to pick it up yourself. 17, 27, and 23. Okay. So, anyway, that's it for you for this week, Pisces. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at vangel.net. Blessings to you.